Hey guys, good morning. I've had a really terrible experience this morning and more than ever, I've just realized how much I hate this country and I'm tired. I was defrauded. Someone accessed my bank account. I'm not sure how, but this person has moved almost all the money that I have in my account and I know that I'm not the only one who is tired. I can't keep doing this and I, I can't keep staying here. So many things just go unnoticed. I've been reaching out to the bank. They weren't responsive because like I work in fintech. So I knew certain people to reach out to. So I'm now the one who is now trying to liaise with like other people to resolve this thing that's happening to me. But if you stay tuned, you'll find out why I hate this country and why I have to leave. Okay, let me give you an insight into where I'm going. One, it's warm and cold. Two, it's not too far from home. Three, there are tons of people who are from other countries who actually live and work here. And four, it's a very, very beautiful, aesthetically stunning city with amazing people. Before we even start talking about this new city that I am moving to, let's talk about life in Lagos. Yes, Nigeria is stressful and there's so many things that don't work in this country and there's so many reasons that these things don't work. Like, can you imagine going to bed and waking up in the morning and getting notifications that more than 70% of the money that you've worked hard for has been taken away from your bank account. I know that it could happen anywhere else in the world, but what was even more painful about this is the lackadaisical attitude of like everyone involved in trying to make sure that this was sorted out. It's one of the things that I really do not like about this country. Some things don't just work and it's very, very depressing. But I love Lagos. played a huge part in my growth as a person. I moved into my first apartment. I made new friends. I saw my friends get married. I tried new things. I even got to travel with the income I made from living in Lagos. Once you've experienced living in Lagos, I feel like you will definitely succeed in living in any other place in the world. This is very weird because somebody across is watching me create YouTube videos. The truth about Lagos is that I did have so many good times and bad times. All of this made me realize that it was time to try something new and when the opportunity presented itself, guess it's okay. Me! What's that thing they say about preparation meeting? Opportunity! Hold up, let's not lie. Being in a new country where you're not originally from, you don't have friends and you're technically living alone because I am living alone in a new country where I know no one is very hard very scary and very daunted. This is one of the things that I've done that is literally pushing me out of my comfort zone because settling in, learning the culture again, trying to familiarize it to yourself 
with something that you're not used to as an adult is very difficult but this was perfect for me and i'm so grateful that these opportunities come my way if you haven't guessed it by now i'm moving to nairobi kenya god guys i'm so excited Nairobi and I'm going to be here for the next three to I don't know months or more so this is home I'm currently filming in my apartment I have settled in quite nicely I've moved into my apartment here I've set up my bank account i.e. M-Pesa mobile money so what should you be expecting next this is a new journey and I'm so happy to be creating and I'm excited so I am definitely going to be taking you along on this journey so if you haven't subscribed at this point in this video do subscribe so that you can stay tuned and be notified when I put out my living or settling in Nairobi content things that I need to do in my time here there's so many recommendations already but if you have things that you believe that I should absolutely do to naturalize in this place just send me your recommendations in the comments section I'm so open because I just want to try everything I feel so excited I feel brand new I'm like I'm busting with excitement and I feel like you can see it on my face and in this video too creating a new life making new friends it's very scary but I'm very excited for this opportunity I can't wait to see the beaches I can't wait to see the wildlife I can't wait to just see who I become in this place that I am so unfamiliar with and I also cannot wait to take you along on my journey thank you so much for watching this video and Stay tuned for more content and if you want to keep seeing this face, don't forget to like, don't forget to share and don't forget to tell me if you've been to Kenya before or if you've lived in Nairobi, what was your absolute favorite thing about it? Help this newbie settle into Nairobi. Asante sana, karibu sana to me and hopefully I learned more Swahili words before I actually live here. See you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching and...